And this is the camper. The beast. Give us a bit of a tour. Actually, you need to tidy it up a little bit first, eh? Hey, so just going to do a quick rundown of this Apollo uh, High Ace High Top van that we hired whilst doing a uh, four day trip here in Tassie. And so just a quick little tour of it. This is really, really cool. It's been really great for us. So if you just come on through here, just the front cabin area, uh, a little bit dusty. We're going to do a clean up. This is our last day. We're going to be returning it, but there's heaps of room here. It's got a GPS radio system. You can charge your stuff. Heaps of room all around. Here inside the um, center console area, heaps of pockets and whatnot. Going inside of here. In here we have a nice little sink here. Heaps of room underneath, like that. And this didn't really rattle around much as we drove. We've got a microwave that works when you're plugged into 240 volt powered site. Got a fridge that works off 12 volt. Uh, heaps of room for all the food that we needed. And over here, you got your basic cookery. We did, however, buy an $8 frying pan because the one they give you, that just ain't going to cut the mustard for your bacon and eggs, okay? So we're just going to leave this here for the next customers. Uh, otherwise, everything else, the, the uh, kettle just works off the um, gas cooker, which is just up here. Something else these Apollo vans have is these little tables. So cool, very, very handy for meal prep and you know, just uh, whatever, they're great. And we always use them for our coffees and just for chopping and food preparation. Inside, you can see we stored our, our suitcases there. And if you look around here to the back here, this all folds out into a nice open bed area. There are, you know, this table comes off easily, sits in between right there and there. There's another piece that's just behind, uh, underneath the suitcases that go here. And this goes in between like that and it forms your bed, which is actually really comfortable. This is really easy to maneuver around as you want it to. We kind of sat outside, to be honest. It was just a little bit nicer to be outside. If you're gonna be cooking in here, you wanna open up these windows just to allow ventilation. Otherwise, room here. Let's go outside. Okay, it's heaps of space in here. Under here, you've got a hose, you've got a bucket and dustpan. Dustpan you'll use like crazy to dust out everything. And lead for the 240 volt power sites. Over here, we got for extra the uh, two camping chairs and the little table over there. They are gold. You wanna get those if you tie this. And just the last thing over here, this is the LPG storage area. It's only a 1.25 liter small baby. Um, we'll turn it off because we're not going to be using it anymore. And that's it, like that. We chose to pay $25 extra to have Apollo refill the gas bottle for us. It might be cheaper for us, but uh, we just thought we'd just dump it and go. Water goes in there, 240 volt uh, plug for your powered campsite and it's good to go. Hope this has been a good little tour of this van. It's great. We enjoyed ourselves. Heaps of room to stand up inside and that's what you want in a camper van. Any questions? Leave a comment.